thanks for watching this uh, video tutorial in this lesson we'll explore more features of uh, graphite modeling tools that help us in our daily work in our previous lesson we looked at uh, adding realism and detail to our cushion using graphite modeling tools please check out our video if you missed out on that I want to add a stitching effect for extra detail on my cushion. Normally this will be done with texturing, but I can achieve similar results with the powerful selection tools in graphite modeling. You'll notice this is a very dense mesh. To add stitching, I need to select edges which will take a long, long time. We have a loop mode that automatically loops an edge on selection and similarly ring mode. Within the set of tools, I have a dot loop feature. Select modify selection and open the drop down. The dot gap parameter sets the spacing between edges along the loop of the edge you select. I'll set it to two. With the selection active, we can add a push modifier to pull in the edges and create a stitched look. I set it to minus 6.5. bump it up to minus 7.5 I realize the fall off of the push effect is a bit sharp so we will convert the object to an editable poly Then we'll activate soft selection and adjust the fall off and make sure the fall off is affecting the right area. I reduce the fall off to say 15. Click on the relax tool once or twice to soften the result. With these simple steps, we have managed to simulate actual stitching to a cushion. Thanks for watching this uh, video tutorial. As always, please thumbs up the video, it really helps. Subscribe and let me know in the comment section if you have any questions or suggestions, or which areas you need clarification on.